fireside chat inside today. Uh, a little windy outside and uh, just can't keep the flames a flickering. So, well, we improvise. Uh, hope everybody's doing good. Uh, not feeling as well <laughs> as pirate -ish and uh, and um, well, uh, let's say salty, shall we? As I was the other day. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I, uh, well, to be honest, yeah, a little bit of a tumble, and uh, yeah, I ended up with about a, I don't know, 500 pound lawnmower all across my body. So, uh, with that being said, and uh, well, my right arm goes about that high, or I guess that's my left arm. <laughs> That's not how it looks in the screen I'm looking at. But anyway, we, uh, yeah, we're still kicking, so. <sighs> anyway, on with today's fireside chat. Uh, yeah, it looks like the temps are going to drop a little bit here for a while. Maybe in the 40s for the high tomorrow. Sucks. Um... And back to uh, the little, the little oopsie daisy that I had there. Uh, well, it was on Wednesday, and I was going to get that video that I posted yesterday out on Wednesday, but that's the reason it wasn't out on Wednesday, as promised. So, yeah, I'm not feeling so piratey today. But uh, I am going to, well, I got some new books in the mail. I guess that's one good thing. Uh, yeah. And uh, on the recommendations of, well, SoCal Piper and, uh, well, Thrift Books in general, Parnassus on Wheels, the, uh, well, the beginning of the Honda Bookshop thing. And uh, I'm really looking forward to getting these. My biggest problem right now is trying to figure out which book I'm going to start with. Because I have this problem, man. Once I start turning pages on one, I know I'm getting close to the end. God, I want to start reading the other one. So, uh, yeah. But, uh, and this one's called uh, The Blessing Way by Terry Hillerman. And I just recently watched... Uh, Dark Winds on AMC Network, and uh, the uh, the Native American cat that plays, uh, well, he plays the uh, Res Sheriff on Longmire. Really like his acting ability. He's a uh, kind of the head honcho on this show, and uh, I thought it was pretty good, so I thought I'd check the book out. Smoking a little bit of the hot chocolate because it's kind of crappy weather out and we got a good fire going in uh, Smoking in the Ganada today. Uh, my favorite pipe and as of right now, kind of my favorite tobacco. So let's get on with the book, shall we? Uh, try to make this short today. I'm not feeling the best about hanging out here by the fire all day. And uh, you guys probably need a break from me anyway after the other day. I know my wife does. Uh, Johnny Cash, Man in Black. Uh, I've read a couple of other Johnny Cash things, but this one's kind of, well, uh, this is, dates back a little ways, so it's got some pretty good pictures in it, too. I'll, I'll let you know on some of these, what I think. And last but not least, and he's got like a thousand books out, and some of his bathroom humor book. Uh, that one's a really good one, too, uh, or a good set of books. And Willie's, well, Willie's just Willie. Everybody's got to like Willie. Uh, well, uh, I think we're going to check out right here, but uh, we're going to give some shout outs as promised in the, in the description of this video. And uh, besides that, I can't afford electricity to keep this fire running forever. Um, our first shout out is going to be to Central Cal Piper. I think he's got like 56 subscribers as of I just looked a little bit ago. Seems like a pretty cool guy. Uh, he gave a really nice introductory video. His name's David. Uh, check him out. Uh, same as everybody else. If you like him, you like him. If you don't, you don't. But uh, I think you'll get along with him. He's pretty cool. Uh, and then there's uh, Sasquatch Piper, who I've heard a lot about lately. I uh, know he's not the big hairy Sasquatch kind of guy, but uh, he's pretty funny. Uh, he's got some good videos, and I know he's been around doing some other stuff from what I've heard for a while, too. So, But uh, he's commented a lot on my stuff and watched my stuff, and uh, 
I will say this, I got unsubscribed to him, and I also got unsubscribed to Hound Dog the other day. And is this happening to anybody else? Because it's like, I'm not unsubscribing, but the, the World Wide Web seems to be doing it for me. So, if anybody's got any suggestions on that. But Sasquatch Piper, I'm still watching you if you're watching this. Um, yeah, so, uh, and I didn't mean to unsubscribe. So, I, I hit that subscribe button back today. So, check out uh, Sasquatch Piper. And I think he's got like 58 subscribers right now, so let's get him up there. And uh, a guy that just commented on some stuff of mine the last yesterday, I think, or the days are kind of running together since I walked my head. <laughs> but uh, uh, it's Paul Johnson. And I'm going to leave the links like I did the other day just right here on the screen because uh, to me it's sad. The whole right the whole line. Anyway, I, I'm just going to do it that way. But uh, Paul Johnson, apparently his daughter's a pipe smoker. He get a kick comes of her in the one video, and uh, they've got a couple pipes they had refurbished from Utah. Uh, once again, uh, I think he has like 30 subscribers, and he's been commenting pretty well on mine, so maybe he's commenting on some of your guys'. Uh, I guess at least give him the privilege of checking him out. Like I said, with anybody, even myself. You like it, you like it. If you don't, you don't have to hit the subscribe button. But, uh, you know, let's jump some YTPC love if we can. And uh, I got to pull the cord on this fire. It's costing me money. Uh, try to heal up over the weekend and bring you good wit and wisecracks from Twain on Monday. Uh, hasta luego, and uh, we'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching.